Okay, let's make a deterministic finite automaton for this language, which is the set of all binary strings w, such that every odd position of w is a 1. And by odd position, we mean odd indices. And in this case, we're going to consider indices to start at 1, unlike most computer scientists. So let's consider the string 1010. So this string in position 1 has a 1. This is, so I'm going to notate the positions right here. This is 1, 2, 3, and 4. So in positions 1 and 3, we have a 1. And so therefore, since every odd position of w is a 1, that string should be accepted. And if we had something even with more 1s in it, that's okay, because every odd position is a 1. That doesn't mean that 1s can't exist otherwise. It just means that the odd position things are a 1. And so that string should also be accepted. If we have 0, 0, 1, 0, then that should not be accepted because position 1, which is odd, does not have a 1 in it. So how are we going to make a DFA for this? Well, we need some notion of odd position, which means odd length, kind of. It's not necessarily that it's odd length, but it's that the odd comes up, which means that we have odd and evenness playing a role here. So we need some way of making a DFA for odd and even. If we have a start state right here, I'm gonna notate that to mean that we are currently going to read the odd position character. So right here, the very first thing that it reads is position one and therefore is an odd position. So therefore we need to read a one right here in order to be in that language in the first place. But then if we come back, which means that we're reading the even position character. There's no stipulation on that, and so therefore it can be anything. So that can be a zero or a one. If we have a zero right here, which means that an odd position is a zero, that should not be accepted. And so therefore it needs to go to a dead state, which will read through the rest of the characters and not accept. But let's think about accepting states. If we're in either of these two states, it's still the case that all the odd positioned characters are ones. And so therefore, both of these states should be final. And so therefore, this is a DFA for all of the binary strings that have odd positions being a one.